Good morning, everybody. Good day. Good talk. V. Gates, how are you? Como están? Buenos dias. Today is Thursday, November 2nd, 2017. Going beyond the grind, going beyond the hustle. Today, again, continuing with listening, active listening, and listening as a key to successful leadership. I want to talk about how to work on listening, how to work on listening. Sure, it's easy to say, you know, open your ears, close your mouth, open your eyes, close your mouth, open, listen, listen with intent. It's easier said than done. I know this. I know this. I know what I'm talking about here. I've been guilty of this. I will sit there and look at you and look at people and then sometimes just be a million miles away, thousand miles away. And that's okay. It is. Don't get me wrong. It is. It's you know. It's it's not fair to the other the other people, the ones that are doing the the ones that are doing the talking, the ones that are relaying information. It's not fair to them. I understand it, but we're human beings. I'm not excusing it. Just it's okay. It happens. But recognizing that it happens and recognizing and doing something about it, now that's where you start letting go of that. You stop being that person. You start being the new one. You start refining and honing your skills, especially your listening skills. The one key that I've, in my experience, that I've found in developing active listening skills is this tool right here. It's one tool. It's We've all had it. We've all seen it. We've all used it. And we can continue to use it. It's the pen. The pen. A working, functional pen. That's it. And obviously, something to write on. Have something to write on. Take notes. Now, there's going to be people that are going to sit there and take every, everything the speaker, the presenter, the person on stage says, and they're going to write it all down verbatim. It's okay. That's their thing. Then there's people that are just going to take and do the, high, the notes. That's fine, too. They're just going to do, you know, the key points, things that they see as just as important to them. But again, that means that they're actively listening for those key points. They're actively involved in what's going on. The person that's transcribing the entire conversation, well, that's good because, again, they're listening and they're writing everything down, and that's how you retain things. You write them down. That's how you become a better listener. That's how you actively listen. That's how you become a better active listener. Write it down. It is that simple. Sure, there's going to be people there. They're going to be there with their little digital recorders or with their phones and record the conversation or film or video the conversation. But that's, again, what do they do with it? They come back and they'll listen to it or watch it. Great. Great. It's excellent. But they're not retaining it. Writing it down, you'll retain more information. You'll find those key points and you're going to then learn from those key points. So write it down, take notes. That's all you need to do. That's the one trick that you need to becoming a better active listener. You know what else you need? You need to make today, this day, today, better than yesterday.